It's Friday. Welcome to Dude RV. We got another edition of Friday's Finds. And man, am I excited about this one. Hold on. I got, I got to get set up. I want to say thank you to Set Power for sponsoring today's Friday's Finds. It's, it's a little big. This is the Set Power TC20 Mobile Freezer. It's a deep freeze, zero degrees to minus 18 degrees. Multiple lev level battery voltage protection. Accurate modulation. <laughs> Let's get this box open and take a look at the set power 21 quart 12 volt freezer Power offers a three-year warranty on their compressor. It has, ah, there's, there's a box of all the connections. That's 20 quarts. So the large side is, is like 19 quarts, and then there's like two quarts here. It's not, a, it's not huge, but for what I'm going to be doing is, it's, I think it's, it's practically perfect for the back, the back of the pickup. Now this lid can be moved somehow. It can be, you can switch the, the side so it'll open from. So let's say you're putting this in the back of the pickup and you want it to open this way. You can flip this lid around so that it does just that. comes with some wheels, a 12 volt power supply, now they, they sell separate a uh, 110 adapter and according to uh, the website Amazon they're currently out of stock on those adapters. Uh, that's most likely due to the COVID-19 supply chain issues. So let me get let me get things set up and assembled, and I'll cut back in. Don't go away. So I have the, the the handle, strap handle, and the cats, or they're not casters, and the wheels installed. So the strap handle is pretty simple. It attaches to the bottle opener. Got a couple of just a little, little strap buckles there. Pretty simple and straightforward. The wheels, they do require a screwdriver. And they go right there on the end. This cooler, the, the set power coolers have battery protection, three levels of battery protection. I've got to figure out how to get some 12 volt power so we can plug it in and look at that and get it cooling down. Stay tuned, more to come. I've had the little portable freezer the amp road portable freezer i've been, been 
I've had it plugged in and running in operation for the last couple of days. Since I, I don't have a 110 adapter, I'm using a battery pack. And we'll be talking about the battery pack next week. But I'm using a battery pack that uh, can be used, charged while being used. The Set Power portable freezer, the 12 volt freezer by, from Set Power. I've, I've had some, I've, I've never owned a, a 12 volt freezer, so uh, this is a learning curve for me. But I've got it set at, at zero. It's showing a zero four Fahrenheit. I presume that's four degrees Fahrenheit. But when we look at the thermometer, it doesn't reflect that four degrees. It's only like 25 degrees, which is fine because if you're freezing stuff and this will be frozen, you know, uh, it's been, it has taken almost six hours, seven hours to get that much ice in the bowl. Tomorrow morning, it'll be frozen solid. Uh, so going from liquid to frozen, this is not it's not great for that, but maintaining frozen. Once it's down to freezing, once the temperature's down at freezing below zero Celsius, below 32 Fahrenheit, uh, it will hold that very well. And then it actually doesn't seem to be using a whole lot of power right now when it's running uh, it's taking about 27 watts uh, there is a battery saver mode on the freezer i have not worked with that yet i'm still learning how it operates so i'll cut back in stay tuned more to come so i've had the set power 12 volt refrigerator powered by the little battery bank here for a couple days had it set below zero for about 24 hours we have a solid block of ice that's pretty cool inside temperature though it's not zero degrees we are at it keeps fogging up can't see it right at 20 degrees so this is set on minus three degrees but that's showing 20. even though that says fahrenheit i, I really think that's a celsius reading regardless we have frozen water so let's take it on the road and see what we can do one of the great things about the 12 volt cooler is you can take cold beverages with you on the go and you never have to stop and buy ice we have we have been camping we've been camping with the set power portable freezer refrigerator finish up this video i just i thought i'd give you a bit of a, an overview and my, my thoughts on the, the set power portable freezer i like it there's, there's a a couple of things that I, i'm not a big fan of one it's it's a little bit weighty uh but that's that's to be expected there's an actual compressor in there so that's it's gonna have some heft to it so but it already feels like you got a, an ice chest full <laughs> it already feels like the ice chest is full but it's not a nice chest and that's one of the things i really like about it it's a dry cooler so you don't have to worry about any of your refrigerated stuff sitting in nasty water uh, i was having a conversation with my friend over the phone last night his daughter's type 1 diabetic and the topic of portable coolers refrigerators just happened to come up 
And he said, you know, I need one of those because my daughter's insulin has to be kept at it in a refrigerated environment. And it's difficult for us to travel with her because we don't have a way to keep her insulin refrigerated. A set power portable freezer will do just that. You can set it so that the temperature is maintained, but it's not a free, not freezing, it's just cold. So that's, that's something I, I would never have thought of because we don't deal with type one diabetes or diabetes at all in our household. But this would be a great addition to anyone that's having to transport insulin or other medical or other medicine that has to be refrigerated and you want to go on a trip. This is a great way to keep that stuff cool. It is available through Amazon. I'll put a link in the card above as well as in the description below. Now I am an Amazon affiliate and I do earn a little revenue anytime you take advantage of one of those links. I do appreciate that. It helps to support the channel. And when you purchase through Amazon, you're, you've pretty well got a guarantee. If you don't like this, that you can send it back. That's one of the things I really like about Amazon. Uh, is there the, the prime, the ability for the customer to try something and if it doesn't work out for them, they can, they can return it. So take advantage of one of those links up there. And I, I thank you for that. If you found this video to be entertaining and enjoyable, please consider clicking on that thumbs up button and sharing me across your social media. That really helps with the YouTube algorithm. I'd, I'd appreciate that. If you've not already, I'd be really honored, truly honored, if you'd consider clicking on that subscribe button and remember to hit that bell as well. And for those of you who have been following along, thank you. That's why I do what I do. That's why I'm out here this morning talking about a, a, a portable refrigerator. And for my patrons, you rock! All right, y'all come back now, you hear?